All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to explain to you, you know, how you can actually get more delivery on Uber Eats, guys. It's actually really, really easy and simple. Now, look, of course, if, you, if you're not getting deliveries on Uber Eats, you're just sitting idle. So you're not making income, which is counterintuitive, right? You're not making money. So you're wasting time, guys. You're damaging your gig income. And I can show you how we can actually get more trips. What you can do first things, guys, actually work more often, okay? Sometimes the most simple options, of course, are the best options, guys. So if you actually want more trips with Uber Eats, you should try to be available more often. Like, for example, you'll definitely get more trips, right? If you're available to complete deliveries for like three hours a day compared to if you were only available for like one hour a day or half an hour a day, okay? Plus, it's also worth considering that if you're actually regularly active on Uber Eats, you might find it easier to actually, you know, select those high value deliveries as well. Now, remember, guys, this is very important, right? You cannot work unlimited hours with Uber Eats. There's actually a limit. And the limit is 12 hours per day. So you need to try to ensure that the hours that you actually work will be worthwhile. You want to find the prime times to be working. Also, it's worth noting, guys, that the average Uber Eats driver, you know, they only do like five to eight deliveries per day. And the second option, guys, where you can do another tip is you can actually enable auto accept. Okay. This is, you know, a good way to earn more trips with Uber Eats, right? And actually, it's actually recommended by Delivery Crazy. So you just enable auto uh, accept. What it does is basically, of course, it's going to give you less control over your deliveries. So it might mean that, you know, you might end up taking gigs you would not usually take. But the auto accept feature basically is one of the best ways to actually stop downtime and uh, from becoming an issue for your earnings guys so we recommend you do this and it will reduce the amount of downtime now another option guys you actually look for the delivery hotspots guys certain areas can sometimes become delivery hotspots where ba basically they have a higher demand for delivery services because maybe maybe it's a local housing estate you know many more maybe many more residents want you know freshly cooked takeaway meals and it could also be you know around where there's a popular restaurant or takeaway chain so whatever the case might be guys you want to look out and identify this hotspot which is a great way of increasing your chances of getting these trips so you want to be in areas where it actually matters to increase your chances of getting these trips guys it's literally that easy and simple guys so if this video helps guys make sure you hit that like button and comment down below your thoughts if you have any other tips you can leave down in the comment a bonus tip would be try to get good ratings so that Uber Eats pushes more deliveries your way, guys. So try to maintain good rating and customer rating and literally that easy and simple, guys. So if this video helps, make sure you hit that like button, comment down below, and make sure you subscribe to the channel so I can see.